Hello friends, good morning, good afternoon, good evening. So this is very important video related VT 2024 and I am going to talk about the fee structure as well as the fees refund till which date you can get the refund. So first let's start with the scholarship part also if your VT rank is between 1 to 10 you get 100% scholarship for all the 4 years. And if your VT rank is between 11 to 50 then you get 75% of scholarship. And if your VT rank is between 51 to 100 then you can get 50% scholarship for all 4 years. And for student up to 500 rank between 101 to 500. 25% you know, tuition waiver for all the four years. So this is the only scholarship which is available based on the VT ranks. Now I will talk about the fee structure. So there are two groups basically in Velour. One is the group A which has the core branches which are like uh, non-computer science, non-ECE branches which are like bioengineering, biotechnology, you know, chemical engineering, civil engineering, triple E, electrical and electronics and electronics and instrumentation, fashion technology and health sciences. So for this stream, your per year fees will be 176,000 which you can check. And this fees is also called the category 1 fee. So a lot of you may already know that in Velour there is 5 categories of fees, category 1 to 5 right so what I showed in the previous for the group A branches category 1 fees is 1,76,000 per year in category 2, 2,35,000 in category 3, 3,43,000 in category 4, 3,68,000 and in category 5, 3,98,000 so that is the Based on your rank, if your ranks are lower, you will have to pay more money per year. Group B is basically for all the branches which are related with CSC, CSC with specialization, IT, EC and others, right? All computer related branches, all etc. will qualify in group B where category 1 fees same way is 1,98,000, category 2 is 3,7,000, category 3 is 4,5,000, Category 4 is 4,48,000 and the last category, category 5 is 4,93,000. Now I will talk about the withdrawal procedure, right, which is the important aspect because if you have booked the seat in this high fees and if you get the better option, you will want to exit from the Vellore because you are joining some college from, you know, JJOSA counseling or CSAP counseling. In that case, you have, you should know the withdrawal process. So, online withdrawal submission in person both are allowed so you can withdraw online also or you can submit your application in person and necessary form for withdrawal should be obtained from the college and submitted that will only enable withdrawal so that is important part and date of application of withdrawal is the date of submitting clearance form so without this clearance form your refund will not be initiated so now let's look into the refund policy itself right how much you are eligible to get if you apply and in under which condition so for not eligible candidates right the students who paid the money but they failed in PCM they got less marks than 60% so you are not meeting the eligibility criteria so you are not asking for withdraw or refund but you have failed to meet the eligibility criteria but you paid the fees so in that case your thousand rupees will be deducted and with taxes 1180 rest of the whole fees what you have paid will be refunded second is now if you are the candidate who want to make a withdrawn request right but you want to make this withdrawal request before the orientation program has started or the last date of the college starting right so college is most probably going to start by 15th of july so if you apply before 15th of july approximately then you are going to get full refund right only 1180 rupees will be charged as a cancellation fee so you so up to the college start date you can get the full refund so that is the good news and next 
if college has already started and now you feel that you want to leave you know so if you are living within 25 days of college starting college has started and within 25 days if you are leaving then also you will get 90% money back only 10% will be deducted so that is your loss 10% 90% will be given back in other condition right you are attending josa counseling or something which is delayed and you want to leave between 25 days after the college start to 40 days of college start in between you will lose 20% 80% will be refunded to that and last one is if you are withdrawing 40 days after the college has started so you are already attended the college for one and a half months and now you want to withdraw in that case you will not get any any money back and the complete amount will be for forfeited and only amount you will get in hand is a caution deposit that's all full amount there will be no refund right there will be no refund at all that's all a short update on the fee structure for this year as well as the refund policy for witty 2024 thanks for watching and please do subscribe channel to get similar important updates